my emotions and my mental pattern were really affecting my physical condition. I had IBS almost my entire life, actually, that I can remember. And after one month of classes, of really utilizing the training as much as I can, it was gone. I was a lost wandering hippie, and I found my life purpose and direction with brain education. My name is Hilary Ranglass. I'm from Chicago, Illinois, and I am the assistant manager at Libertyville Body and Brain Yoga Tai Chi. Before brain education, I was a lost, wandering hippie, <laughs> trying to find uh, my life purpose, trying to find something to hold on to. So what I was doing was actually woofing worldwide opportunity on organic farms in California and Oregon. And then I went to go get my permaculture design certificate in Israel. So when I was in Israel, I actually went to many different uh, eco villages and I was really able to receive a lot of amazing information. And I thought, okay, this is exactly what I want to do. But the way that I went about it was very ungrounded <laughs> and I sort of just went from place to place to place connecting with these people and then a couple weeks later connecting with different people different people and essentially I ended up really depleted of energy my intestinal health was incredibly depleted I had uh, stomach aches all the time and I would go from extremes to of gut health issue you know constipation or IBS and I really couldn't figure out what it was I would try to stop eating for a while or try to stop eating this 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 but actually what it was was simply I was not really grounded in myself and I wasn't really taking care of myself properly in an energetic way, in a physical way, proper healing way. So I came back, uh, I came back to Chicago after uh, traveling and wandering for a really long time and doing woofing, trying to find myself and find what I was supposed to do. And I actually received a one week free of classes. So I went to the local body and brain center and I learned brain education which really helped me to uh, look at myself and notice the things that were actually inside of me instead of keep running away to the next thing and try to avoid who I really was and what I was hanging on to. And especially what I learned is through healing my body, especially my intestines, that was a big part of grounding myself because the lower chakra system after I think it was probably about one month or even honestly less than that, my intestinal issues were gone. I had IBS almost my entire life actually that I can remember. And after one month of classes of really utilizing the training as much as I can, it was gone. And I was like, I have to tell this to everybody. <laughs> this is the most amazing thing ever. I could notice through the training is that actually my emotions and my mental pattern were really affecting my physical condition. And so the way that I changed, um, this of course took <laughs> some time, certain things took some time, certain things were quicker than others, right? But through doing the training habitually, my emotions started to purify. And what does that mean? It means I could forgive. And I could actually let go of pain that I had with my family, pain that I had with my own internal struggle with people that I had met throughout my life. Um, whatever traumas I've had, you know, my parents getting divorced, I could really open that up, look at it and forgive and then be more unconditionally loving. My favorite brain education principle is choose it and it will happen. And then trust, trust my choice unconditionally. What I would tell my old self is don't be afraid to stay in one place and face everything because through simply facing the things that are coming up you will open yourself, you'll open to new layers of yourself and then uncover who you really are. You don't necessarily have to go out to go in. You can actually just go in and then everything else will come out. <laughs> Love yourself.
a lot unconditionally. Don't look for love outside. Really choose to love yourself inside and receive love. Be okay to receive love and then give unconditionally also. Keep trusting. I was a lost wandering hippie and I found my life purpose and direction with brain education. 